maybe you're going on a road trip and uh, you told yourself, you know what, man, I don't have enough space for the stuff that I need to bring. I might have a solution for you. In come the Nelson Rig Traveler Trunk Tour Bag. Let's talk about it. Stay tuned. <laughs> So some of you guys know that um, my wife and I, we just took off on a shy of 5,000 mile motorcycle road trip. And of course, in figuring out packing and bringing the right gear and leaving gear behind, um, we find out really quick that we need more space. So I'm the kind of guy that in my saddlebags of the motorcycle, um, I carry some essential items with me, like tools, rain gear, and then uh, different temperature riding gear. And then I have found that in my tour pack, uh, a lot of my camera gear has taken up that space. So that doesn't leave me a lot of space for clothes and for you know toiletries and things like that so that's kind of where this bag comes into play now this is a travel bag or you know it's the traveler trunk bag now this is motorcycle luggage that is catered to the touring rider okay so if you have a trunk a tour pack and it has a luggage rack on top of it then that's where this goes okay now, this does have universal mounting straps. So again, as long as you have that tour pack or that trunk with the rack on top, you can strap this onto your bike and have additional storage space. Now, I put this back to the test. We rode 4,786 miles across six different states, different types of temperature, weather, you know, it, it, we used it everywhere. We were from 48 degrees all the way to 112 degrees. And um, it performed absolutely flawlessly. You know, mounting it on the bike was fast. Taking it off the bike was fast. Particularly at the end of the day when you're just ready to get into the hotel, relax a little bit and unwind. You want to take this off as quickly as possible. But I figured, let's go ahead and just dissect this bag and let's look at it together. And then let me show you a couple of clips of me on my road trip of you just seeing where I was at while I had this bag attached to my bike. But uh, how about we just start with the outside? The material that you see on here, it is a material that Nelson Rig calls the Ultramax. Now it does have UV protection against fading. And while it is water resistant, it's not waterproof, but I'll touch on that in a little bit later with the waterproof cover that it has. This does have a lifetime warranty. Universal fit, I did mention that already. If you happen to run out of space with this bag, it actually expands an additional three inches. See? Which collapsed, or at its normal state, it's 63 liters of space inside, and then expanded 73 and a half liters. Just so you get a grasp on the size of this bag, you can fit two full-size helmets inside, unexpanded. It does have a rigid construction. You can see that this bag is empty. And I'll show you obviously the inside, but it does not collapse on itself. It does have this nice reflective piping on top, on this pocket, as well as the side pockets. It's got carry handles on each side, as well as a carry handle on the rear so you can hold it like it was a suitcase. 
Your zipper is also water resistant. Again, not waterproof, but water resistant. Your front pocket, it's a nice large pocket. This is your rain cover, we'll go over that in a second. One thing to note are the pull tabs. They are nice, generous, good quality pull tabs. When you have your gloves on or it's cold, you want something easy to open it up with. Like I said, lots of space in that one. Pocket on the sides, again, generous size pocket. Put those items that you want quick access to. Okay. Same material on the bottom. So it's not gonna scratch up your rack. I had it on there for, like I said, um, under 5,000 miles and there was no roughed up scratching on my rack at all. It does have this nice uh, leather-like, this is vinyl on top. Now let's go ahead and move to the inside. So on the lid itself, on the inside, it actually does have a zippered mesh pocket. Now what we used it for was to kind of just put like, you know, undergarments, your socks, and some small items in there. Works out great. Quick access to it when you're in a hotel. You just butt it up against the wall and you're good. It also does have two zipper pockets on each side. Again, just to put some extra things in there, you know, whatever you want. You do have this strap right here in the middle to hold your clothes if you kind of want to keep your clothes separate without it getting all mixed up or moving around. And then inside, what keeps that shape is it does have this hard plastic lining inside. So, you know, you can, uh, that way it stays up. It doesn't collapse on you. Nice and open. Say so you could put a lot of clothes in there. So, touching on the rain cover. Now, one of the things is, is you could probably go through a really light rain and I've done it before with it, but the real heavy rain, you really need to wrap it up in this cover right here, okay? This is 100% waterproof cover. So when you put your rain gear on, put the rain gear on to this bag. Now, this is a very secure bag because when you get your straps here, and I'll show you these. You'll put this on. And I'll just kind of show you so-so. This part right here. See if you can see that. Let me get a little closer. This little buckle, when you set it up, goes through this little section right here. This strap obviously goes on your rack and you pop this in and you Velcro right over. Why do you do it that way? So that when you're rolling down the road and the wind's flapping because it will grab this, it won't start to pull it off because you actually have it hooked in between the buckle and this strap. The rain cover does have the Nelson Rig Route 1 logo on it, which is super nice because this is also reflective. So it just adds a little bit, since you're gonna be covering up all your piping, this kind of just puts that reflectiveness back on there. So again, who is this bag for? This bag is for the traveler. This bag is for the person that travels. It's got a trunk on their bike. Traveler, trunk, tour bag. Is it gonna hold everything you want? That depends on what that everything is. Now, um, to give you an example, I carried about three shirts, two pairs of pants, bunch of socks and underwear. Same thing with my wife. Um, I think she had like a blow dryer in here. Um, we had two pairs of like flat shoes, you know, that I have, that I had and then she had. Um, we had some toiletries in here. We had plastic bags. The rain cover goes in here in the front bag. That's where we left that one. Okay. Uh, little first aid kit or like some band-aids and bandages. Sunscreen. We also had um, 
some extra little neck wraps that you can soak in water that we had in there. Um, toothpicks, lotion, chapstick. When I was buying stickers on the road, I was jamming them in there. Um, this gave me quick, easy access. I would actually put my GoPro camera in here with um, its own tripod. So it was easy for me to unzip right here and just pull it out from right there on top. There, are, there were times when we were riding that um, Ruthie needed to either put a sweater in here or take a sweater out. And rather than digging through the saddlebags or trying to rearrange, we just laid it on top. Same thing with the rain gear. Once we got to a spot that we were nice and dry and the rain gear was dry, we just laid it on top inside and we just kept on going. A lot of people tend to buy souvenirs on the road. So for us in particular, we just picked up some extra shirts. So that added to our gross product that we had in here, right? By adding an extra couple of shirts. Um, I think it was maybe an extra four shirts. It didn't even make a dent. So, I mean, it can carry a lot of stuff. You know, um, it's only limited to what you want to bring and how much of that stuff you want to bring. You could probably even say, I'd rather just use this than having to load up my tour pack because I can just take this off very easily. If you have any questions, just put them down below in the comments section and uh, I will answer those as best uh, to my knowledge. But I hope that I have given you a thorough review of the Nelson Rig Traveler Trunk Tour Bag. This is their NR300 bag. I will put a link down in the description below to nelsonrig.com so that you can go check out this bag in particular, but as well as all their other luggage options in their Route 1 series. Let me show you some of that footage of uh, my road trip so you can see just how road proven this bag is. But until next time, deuces. Deuces.